Hey guys! Hey! Hey! Hey, look, I'm playing Minecraft! Whoa! Hey! Whoa, Minecraft! Whoa! Alrighty guys, what is going on? How is it going? My goodness, my goodness, it's been a while. Hope you guys are enjoying the UHC season I'm putting out. Yeah, yeah, UHC's fun in Minecraft. Yay, look at my hole. I've got a big hole. Um, yeah, so what's going on guys? How's it going? It's been a while. I'm not dead. I'm not dead guys. I'm not dead. I have not quit YouTube forever and ever as despite what some of you guys may think. Um, I am alive. I am still on the cube. I've actually got this little project I'm working on. I'll show you guys in just a second once I kill some of my undead friends over here. Yeah, let's just we'll just climb down. All right, so I've moved my beacon over here into this uh, giant deserty area. Um, actually, I, I was saving this area to build a desert village place, but I'll show you guys where it is in relation to everything. God, I have to eat freaking melons, dude. I don't know what happened on my chicken. Ugh. So, my hill's all the way over there. Um, also, I'm kind of sniffly. Hopefully that doesn't annoy too many of you guys. So, like, sniffles. I got the sniffles! But my house is over there. And then you got this desert over here. And then back here, kind of already made like a natural little divot area. So, I decided to kind of blow it the F up. And make myself a little hole. So, we're going to go travel down there. Real quick, it, it'll just take us like, just a matter of seconds. Just watch, this is great, this is great. All right, peace out. Oh man, this zombie's gonna get me. I suck, uh -huh. <laughs> All right, so we come down here. Oh yeah, I forgot. Put the slime blocks down. Oh yeah, oh yeah, uh, look at me, being smart. Yeah. Oh, I got a big booger in my nose, man. I got a big booger. So, this is what I've been doing on the cube the past couple weeks. Uh, slowly but surely, I have kind of made myself a giant ass freaking hole in the ground. So we're gonna check. It. Oh wait, I gotta tell you guys the most important part. So this beacon has uh, has haste two, haste two right now, and uh, I've got efficiency five, fortune three, and I'm breaking three on my pickaxe, which is basically the best thing you could have on a pickaxe like ever. Um, but Ah, it's been great. It's been a good time. I've got a decent amount of stuff going on. I've got quite a decent amount of diamonds, quite a decent amount of coal and iron, and of course, a bunch of freaking cobblestone as well. This is pretty great. But basically, I just wanted to start up this little this little thing down here, just so I could, I don't know, get some more diamonds. Because lately, I just haven't been haven't been doing that. I just haven't been mining at all. Oh my goodness, I'm breaking shit already. My God, my God. But th this is this is not really what I wanted to show you guys. What I wanted to talk to you guys about is what's going on. Basically, I haven't been doing YouTube for like the past two weeks and I think you guys deserve a little bit of an explanation. And so that is what I was gonna do in this episode. But of course, I did want to go run around and do a couple things and you know entertain the visual aspects of the video. Yeah, wow. So we're gonna go check out my sheep farm in just a little bit. I'm gonna have to figure out how to get up there. And then we will tell you guys what is going on in the life of Kermit. Oh my goodness. I hope you guys are ready for some cool shit. Yeah. Wait, before before I go, before before I leave this majestic area, I want to show you guys the dam the type of damage that Efficiency 5 pick does with the haste 2. This is this is great. So as you see, there is a there's a little bit of stone here. And, uh, and just a quick little second. Woo! Woo! Yeah! That's what I'm talking about. Uh, oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Uh, 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 uh. Holy crap. I'm so glad I stayed down here to do that. Wow, I just got 12 freaking diamonds. I guess I got 12 freaking diamonds, guys. I got 12 freaking diamonds. Ow! 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 Alrighty, so we are on our way over to our house, over to our sheep farm, We're trying not to get shot by skeletons. Yeah, 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 yeah. Alright, so, first I just wanted to tell you guys that I am not dead. 
I am not quitting YouTube. And for those of you who do follow me on, on Twitter, or for those of you who don't even know what's going on, I am not doing YouTube full time anymore. And what this means is that I'm not going to be producing daily videos. And I'm going to explain to you guys why in just a minute. But first, I want to explain to you guys that you guys are freaking awesome. I am so freaking thankful to have you guys to be a part of my life. I, I cannot ever stress this enough. I don't think any YouTuber ever really can explain what you guys mean to us. Fans are freaking, it's, it's intense. The support you guys give us, the support you guys have given me throughout this past year of YouTubing experience is freaking amazing. And I would have never even dreamt being supported by this, this amount of people. Even though it has gone down over time, and we'll talk about this in just a second. Even though it has gone down over time, you guys are still freaking the best. The ones who have stuck with me. Uh, I just want to say thank you. Thank you for the experience. I will... Uh, I don't know. I've grown so much from this. And you guys, you guys are to blame. So, I love you. I love you. <laughs> Alright, so, I'm going to start off with going back to when I very first started YouTube, which was... Uh, I think I made the account, like, February 24th is the date. Or maybe it's March 24th. But, uh, yeah. Oh, oh, we've got 15 diamonds. Yeah! Awesome. Oh, yeah. Oh, so this is my little sheep farm, guys. Um, I haven't shown you guys this, bu this building at all. We'll, we'll hold we'll hold on a conversation for just a second. So this is my little sheep building. Um, you come in here. Whee! Little doors. You know, other than that, you can't leave. No, you're not allowed to leave. This is an entrance. Entrance only. And the exit's over there. And you come in here. You pay, pay five diamonds, and you go, hey, shit, on the sheep. Yeah, 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 uh, uh, look at my carpet, yeah, yeah, yeah. So this is pretty cool. Um, I've got my sheep farm up and running. I don't really have the best system of, the best breadstone payment system. I know some people have some pretty cool systems going on, but whatever. You know, five diamonds, get as much wool as you want. I've got... Three customers so far. Thank you, mysterious three customers. I love you so much. <laughs> yeah. Ugh, I'm having to pause the recording every like three minutes to blow my nose. All right. So anyway, as I was saying, February 24th, I'm pretty sure is when I made the Minecraft channel, Current Plays MC, and I think I posted my first video like in March, beginning of March, I think. I don't even know. I don't even know. We'll have to go back and look. But it was the first walls video. Um, actually, no, we should start way before YouTube ever started. So, as you guys probably know, there is a, there is a man out there who goes by the name of, of Sky Does Minecraft. Um, him and I were fairly good friends during high school. Um, I graduated and I lived with some friends and I lived back with my mom. And then in January, maybe the end of January or the beginning of February, he's like, yo man, I'm moving back into the area. You got, we should hang out, blah, blah, blah. So we started hanging out. We, we were good friends since high school. And then he asked to move in with me. Or he asked if I wanted to move in with him. I'm like, hell yeah, dude, get me out of my mom's house. That's freaking sweet. I'll go get a job. Or I had a job. I had a job at Cinnabon, which is freaking pretty cool. You know, Cinnabon, if you guys know what Cinnabon is, little cinnamon rolls. They're freaking delicious. I got to eat like four of them every freaking day. It was awesome. Oh my God. I actually really, really like that job. But. I had a crappy little cinnamon job, a cinnamon bond job, and he's like, yeah man, move in with me, pay a little bit of rent, blah, 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 we'll hang out. And then two weeks after, um, two weeks after we, we moved in, or I moved in, he's like, yo, what do you think about this YouTube thing? You, would you want to do it with me? And of course, you know, me having a brain, I was like, holy crap, yeah! Oh, fucking boss play Minecraft! That sounds awesome! And so he started up my Minecraft channel, and within, I don't know, within like two weeks, I think I had like 15,000 subscribers. And then within like a month, I had a ridiculous amount of support just straight off the beginning. Oh my God, these kids just came in flocking like nobody's business. The support Sky gave me was unbelievable. I have 792,000 subscribers and I got all of that within about, within, within less than half a year. By August, or uh, I don't know when I left him cracked. I think I left in July, maybe. Uh, no, it was beginning of summer. So I left him cracked in June, 
and by then I had about 750,000 subscribers and I'm pretty sure that's about five months worth five or six months worth of, of minecrafting got me that amount of subscribers and that's almost entirely due to, to the support this guy has given me I'm not gonna try to sit back and be like yeah man look what I did for myself uh, I put myself up from nothing when that's that's honestly not the case um, I, I received a lot of help from Adam. I received a lot of help from Deadlocks and Husky Mudkips and Ascendi taught me a lot. Like Ascendi taught me how to do my first mod showcase. Like th these were great guys in my opinion. I was a part of a great team. Um, I couldn't be more thankful from where I come from. And guys, if you guys are watching this, once again, I just want to say thank you for the experience. Like I feel honored for you guys to have picked me up like you guys did and to teach me what you guys have taught me. And despite what has gone down and various aspects of life, I, I still do really respect you guys. You guys are freaking the shit. Like, I love what you guys do. You guys are great Minecrafters. One of the few Minecrafters that can actually make me laugh by just watching their videos. Um, yeah, it's oh, freaking great. So, thank you guys. Thank you, Team Crafted. Thank you, Adam, for participating, for supporting me, for giving me this great opportunity. I would not be here if it wasn't for you guys, and I do not want you guys to forget that I am thankful. I don't want the people to un to miss the point that you got you guys basically made me. You know, like current plays Minecraft would not be around without Skyder's Minecraft. It would not be around without S Sunday or Deadlocks or any of the guys. Basically, like it would have just been nope, not gonna happen, bro. Not gonna happen. But anyway, all right, moving on. So made the Minecraft account. Everything was going great, and then uh, my girlfriend and I. Decided it was time to move out into our own place. And unfortunately there were complications that came along with that idea. So, I know Adam and I have been living with each other. And I'm not, I'm not going to go into too many details because it does involve another person. And it does involve another person's personal life. So I'm not going to go into too many details because it's not my life to talk about. But basically Adam and I, we had a little bit of, a, little, a couple disagreements. And I, I was off kind of doing my own thing. I was off my own world. I had just started making money in YouTube and that was blowing my mind. I had a girlfriend to take care of. There was just a lot going on. And I kind of lost my way within Team Crafted. I was going off doing my own thing. I, was, I wasn't even uploading thumbnails. I don't know why. Like people had made thumbnails for me and I still just wasn't uploading them. I was like, nope, I don't need thumbnails, man. I'm too good for that shit. Uh-uh, not for me. I don't know why I, I was like that, but I was a little arrogant. I don't know if it was the ego boost. I don't know if it was because all of a sudden 700,000 people were following me. Like, it's a little hard to handle. If you can imagine um, just having that amount of people just follow you within five months. You go from nothing. You go from working at Cinnabon to playing Minecraft every day and making money off of that. That's pretty surreal. That's, holy fuck. That's pretty intense. And it, it does go to your head, guys. Believe it or not, having hundreds, thousands of people follow you and like you and praise you and tell you how awesome you are every single day, it does go to your head. Trust me. It does. But anyway, um, Adam and I had a couple disagreements within the house, within our own personal lives. And then uh, I guess other things that were going on were just, you know, di disagreements within Team Crafted. We had different styles. I guess it wasn't really disagreements, but it was basically just we had different styles. Like, I was much more laid back. I didn't play mini games as often. Um, I just didn't really like the mini game idea. I didn't do mod showcases like everybody else did. But the main thing was that I didn't do upload thumbnails. That was the main thing, was I didn't upload thumbnails, and my channel wasn't the most neat looking, quote unquote. And so the guys talked to me like, hey man, we'd really like it. I mean, this is just paraphrasing, of course, but they were like, hey man, we'd really like it if you could, you know, upload thumbnails, uh, organize your descriptions a little bit better, you know, give credit to these people and these people. I was, of course, st still a noob and all this. I was like, yeah, all right, I'll start shaping things up. And of course, I went in and I edited my descriptions and blah, 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 blah. But then a couple days later, they called me again and basically, what went down is they still didn't like the work I was doing and so they gave me a couple days 
they were like, hey man, you should fix this up in a couple days or we'll have to talk again. And basically right then and there, I was like, no, I'm, I'm kind of done. Um, I wanted to do my own thing. I was off making my own friends for the first time in Minecraft, in the Minecraft YouTube history. I was, I had my own friends. Uh, Wolfles and I were recording Crush Depth and that was going great for me. And I was like, you know what? Team Crafted has been good to me, but I think it's time for me to go off and do my own thing. And so that's obviously what had happened is I started recording with other people. Um, I didn't record with Team Crafted as much. And then eventually it was just like, all right, you know what? I don't think I'm a part of this team anymore. I'm going to go do my own thing and I'm going to leave Team Crafted. And so that's what happened. I left Team Crafted. I had to change my artwork. I had to change my banner. Um, they removed me out of their sub boxes. You know, the whole shenanigans that went down last summer. And I don't know. I, there was a lot of drama. A lot of questions were asked. A lot of people were just stuck like, what the fuck just happened? Like, why Why did Kermit leave? Why, why isn't Kermit recording with Sky anymore? Like, are you guys still friends? Do you guys hate each other? What the heck is going on? And out of... Uh, Hmm. Out of respect for Team Crafted, and out of wanting to not fuel the drama, I kind of just ignored the questions as best as I could. Um, I told people that, you know, I left for my own reasons, you know, we're still friends, blah, 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 blah. You know, we might record with each other, but obviously we never did. Um, I think we recorded like two mini games, maybe like a month and a half ago, because we met up at Minecon. No, actually, we had sushi the other day. Well, not the other day, but like <laughs> two months ago. But, um, but yeah, so I left Team Crafted. I left a lot of people with questions. And Sky stopped recording with me, or everybody stopped recording with me. Um, I, I, wish, I wish things had gone differently. You know, I wish I wasn't so stuck up my ass. You know, I wish I was more humble about it. Things probably would be a lot different than they are now. But nonetheless, I can't. I can't change the past. I'm. I'm sorry for the way things went down. I'm sorry for any disrespect I have caused anybody. I don't know why everybody just stopped recording with me. Uh, once I left Team Crafted, it was. It was pretty rough. All of a sudden, you know, all these people that I thought were my friends, or they. They were my friends, but all of a sudden, everybody just stopped recording with me. And this doesn't just go for Team Crafted members because they have their own reasons. Um, at that time, Team Craft was just starting up, and at that time, they still they wanted to keep a brand name, so they didn't want to record too much with people outside the team. And I, I was like, "All right, you know what? I, I respect that. That's completely reasonable." But unfortunately, I don't know. Rumors started to spread about why I left Team Crafted and about who I was as a person. Rumors and you know just just personal facts of my life. I don't know where these rumors started or where people got this information, but people started to come to me with questions about my personal life. Like, hey man, are you okay? We heard this and this and this. And I was like, oh, oh really? Where, where could you have possibly heard this information from? And obviously it didn't go very far. But I don't know, people stopped recording with me right as I left Team Crafted, which I don't know, kind of amazes me. It's almost like they only recorded with me because I was part of the Cool Kids Club, quote unquote. And I mean, I don't really think that surprises me. I think that makes perfect, totally, perfect, total sense. In a, in a fucking business, oh, what is it called? Uh, in a community that works like the Minecraft YouTube community, you have to, you have to stay fresh. You have to stay cool. You have to get views if you want to succeed. And unfortunately, that just wasn't where Kermit plays Minecraft lied anymore. He wasn't a part of the Cool Kids Club anymore, and so. I don't know, people just, you know, stopped messaging me. They stopped recording with me. They stopped inviting me to things. When I invited them to things, they're like, oh, no, that map sounds shitty now. I don't know why it sounds shitty now, but I'm just going to give you a shitty reason as to why I'm not going to play it with you. I need food. Um, but, yeah, I'm going on quite the rant here. Wow. All righty. All right, so we're going to continue on. I left him crafted. That was all fine and dandy. I was doing my own thing. I, I just wanted to move forward. Um, let me get some of this. Yeah, yeah, this is sweet. Okay, so I left him crafted in the beginning of summer 2013. 
And then the rest of the summer was pretty good. You know, I still was doing Shop and Survival. And I did a couple mod showcases every now and then. And I was playing with Perpetual Jordan and other friends of mine. And life, life was still going forward, in my opinion. But almost, almost instantly, since I stopped recording with Adam and Team Crafted, I saw a drop in views and a drop in subscribers. And I'll show you guys this in just a second, I think. Maybe not. I don't know. There's a, you can look up analytics. You know, it's really not that hard to look up the view count and the subscriber count of different YouTubers. If you just Google it, you'll be able to do it. It's really not that hard. So if you guys are really interested in seeing how the stats changed for me since, uh, since June, then you can. It's really not hard. I'll uh, post something down in the description for you guys to check out if you guys want. Um, I'm, okay, first of all, I pride myself on being real. I don't like being fake. I don't like putting on masks. I like being honest. I like being open. And I like, I don't know, just being a real person. Like a real genuine person who doesn't bullshit everybody. Who doesn't feed everybody a bunch of crap so they like them. You guys have been faithful to me. And this in turn, in my opinion, is me being faithful to you. I want to tell you guys what happened. In my words, in my... Humblest words, in my opinion. Humble. I'm trying to be humble about this. I'm not trying to be a douche about this. I'm not trying to be like, Yeah, man! I was rich and famous and successful, and now you guys should just take pity on me because I'm a lonely little frog who needs Minecraft to live. No, I don't really want to be like that. I'd rather sit down on the cube and tell you guys what's up in as real of a way as I can, and this is it. So... After I left him crafted, there was a dramatic drop in views and subscribers, and for a while I was like, you know what, man, like, it doesn't really matter. I'm still going to do what I, I love to do. I'm still going to be faithful to my subscribers. I'm still going to upload videos. I'm going to play with who, who I can play with. Um, soon after, I was introduced to this fellow named Think Noodles. I played a mini game with him, and he's like, yo, man, we got this. UHC thing going on, would you like to be a part of it? And I was like, hell yeah, dude, that sounds freaking sweet. And so he added me into this group, the UHC group, and that's where I met Grazer and uh, Straub and Vass and Bayani and all these great guys that uh, I've been in recordings with ever since. Um, they're freaking sweet. If you guys don't know who the crap I'm talking about, you guys definitely go check out Grazer10. He's the founder, or not the founder, the, uh, the hoster of the UHC that I am currently in right now, which is going to be uploaded very soon. I don't know if it's going to be uploaded today. I don't know when I'm going to upload this video, but it's a ultra hardcore, great series, great thing to play. I freaking love playing it, and I'm never, ever, ever going to stop. No, no, never going to stop. Yeah, never. Yeah. So I was introduced to these guys, and they were pretty freaking cool. And you know what? I started to think on the brighter side of things, like yeah. This is all right, you know, Team Craft was awesome, but, you know, there's still a bunch of awesome people out there. Whew. I'm just going to play around and keep doing my thing for as long as I can. And, unfortunately, that, as long as I can, that time period is, unfortunately, up. Like, I don't know, I never stopped losing views. I never stopped going down in subscriber count. More and more people just stopped watching me. More and more people just stopped subscribing to me. Um, once again, you guys can see this all online. I'll put down a link. Maybe I'll even put a picture up. I don't even freaking know. But, ooh, my voice is getting a little shaky. This is intense. <sighs> but yeah, unfortunately, people did stop watching me. And uh, as heartbreaking as that is, you know, I decided over time, obviously I noticed this almost, almost right away. By the end of summer, oh my God, it was like, Wow, where the crap, what happened? Like, where did all my views go? I just stopped getting subscribers. Um, like I said, I left Team Crafted with 750,000 subscribers. Um, and I got all that within about five or six months. And I'm at 792, six months later, I've gained 42,000 subscribers. So for the first six months, while I was in Team Crafted, I gained 750,000 subscribers. The next six months after that, I gained 42,000 subscribers. If that just gives you a little bit of an idea of where subscribers come from, 
I hope it does because subscribers don't just pop out of their ass and subscribe to you because they want to. They, they subscribe to you because of other reasons as well. At least that's my situation. I know there are plenty, plenty, plenty of other great YouTubers who have literally started from the bottom. People watch them, they're like, oh my god, this guy's freaking awesome, and then they subscribe to him. But I guess that just, I don't know. I don't know why it's not the case for me. Maybe people have just already seen me. They're like, oh yeah, that's that frog dude that used to play, that used to be cool, but he's not cool anymore. So we're just going to stay subscribed to him, but not watch his videos. Because I have 790,000 subscribers, and I am, as of today, I'm lucky to get 10,000 views on a video. When I get 10,000 views on a video, that's a good day for me. I'm like, hell yeah, I got 10,000 views, sweet. Maybe, I don't know how many that is. That's like less than a percent. Yeah, less than a percentage of my freaking subscribers sticked around. Oh, by the way, I am so thankful for you less than a percentage of subscribers. Like, there are still people who, uh, I started off this video saying thank you to these people. To the people who have stayed with me through everything, who have stayed with me through Team Crafted, who, are, who still watch me even though I don't play with the cool kids anymore. You guys are freaking great. I love you guys. Like, I would I would literally be starving on the streets if it wasn't for you guys. <sighs> but, unfortunately, I am about to be starving on the streets. Uh, YouTube cannot pay for my house anymore. It is no longer a full-time job. I need to go find other sources of income if I want to live. Like right now, I've got some potatoes and some box noodles in my cupboard. That's what I've been eating the past couple days just because I'm fucking broke. But that brings me into into the next part of my conversation. I'm gonna get out of here. This is I've been walking around here forever. Whew. All right, so that'll bring me into the next part of my conversation. YouTube is a job, people. People make money off of playing Minecraft. When you watch our videos and you see uh, you see the little you see the little five second ads that you probably skip past as often as you can, which is perfectly fine. I don't really care. But those. Those generate revenue, which go towards some sort of company like Machinima or Broadband or TGS. And then through those companies, they'll take their percentage, they'll take their cut, let's say like 20%. And then I'll get 80%, depending on the contract I sign. And then also CPM comes into play, which is uh, capital out or some, I don't even know. I think it's like capital per monetization. Don't hold me against, don't hold that against me. That might be wrong. It's probably wrong. If you really want to know, go look it up. But basically, it's how much money um, you gain per thousand views or something like that. And it goes up and down depending on what's going on that month. Um, for example, right during the Super Bowl, CPM is like ridiculously high. If you post really good videos during the Super Bowl, you're probably going to gain a couple hundred bucks or a couple hundred thousand bucks depending on who you are. And uh, yeah. So you get paid during, for these videos, for these ads that people watch. Um, and of course, the more views you get, the more money you get paid. Um, I'm not gonna go into details because, oh, it's a personal thing. I'm not gonna throw anybody under the bus, but I'm gonna let you guys know that, let's see, for about, uh, th now this is my contract. This is just me specifically. This rate changes for people for, across the board. But for me, for about, Let's see, the peak, the peak of what I made, uh, I never made more than $10,000, but I got close. And I got, I think the maximum, uh, this is per month, um, the maximum amount of views I got was I think four and a half million views a month. And I'm, I'm gonna give you a range between $5,000 and $10,000 is what I made that month. For four, four and a half million dollars, I made between $5,000 and $10,000 that month for playing Minecraft, and that's all I did. That's all I did, and I gained a decent paycheck, I paid for a house, I fed myself, and I've almost always had a roommate or a girlfriend living with me that I've basically adopted and taken care of because I had extra money that I didn't really know what to do with, so I'm like, yeah man, you can you can live with me, I can, I can feed you, I can... No, buy you things every now and then. Like, I had too much money, in my opinion, uh, for a 19-year-old. A 19-year-old who own houses. Like, I don't know what's up with that, but, you know, it's not all that, 
tall, not all that natural. So I didn't really know what to do with all this Minecraft money that was flowing in. And let me tell you guys, like, I am not a big Minecrafter. There are people out there making a lot more money than I am, doing a lot more, being a lot more successful, I guess, is the right term for it. But, yeah, so that, that's, that's what's going on. Um, I was making a decent amount of money. I got a house. I'm sitting in it right now. I'm still paying for rent or trying to. What the crap is up with that? And I was just doing my own thing. And then all of a sudden, you know, the viewers went down. The view count went down. The subscriber count went down. And in turn, my paychecks also started to go down. And for a while, I was like, alright. You know, we'll cut back on the ridiculous spending. We'll buy food that is actually smart to buy. We won't just buy fuck tons of Hot Pockets and eat them all. Um, and so I started to wisen up a little bit. You know, oh my gosh, I actually have to be frugal, frugal with my spending. I'm just, I'm just walking around, by the way. I don't, I don't know where the crap I'm going. But, I don't know, the past couple months, um, it's just not been the same. I'm going back up, fuck this. <laughs> It's just not been the same, you know, uh, the paychecks that have been coming in are barely enough to feed me, let alone pay for my house. There are bills I can't pay for. Um, like I said, I have a roommate living with me and like, uh, we're, we're both looking for jobs or actually I've already found a job, but we're looking for jobs and yeah, I mean, life's all right. You know, I'm not dying. I mean, I'm a little hungry right now. I had some pizza last night, that was pretty good. <sighs> but anyway, alright. On to the next thing. So, I started off this video saying I wasn't going to do YouTube full time. And I still rest by that. And I hope you guys understand why. Um, I, I have to go find another job. I have to go spend my time elsewhere where I can actually, you know, pay for food. And pay for my bills. And pay for rent. Stuff like that would be nice and unfortunately I just can't do that on YouTube anymore. I'm not gonna sit around and I don't know just wait for something magical to happen. You know I've been I've been trying I've been trying out different things, trying out different series um, as to whether or not to revive my channel or something like that. But the way I see it in the Minecraft community, you know, ten thousand people out of seven hundred and ninety thousand people watch me. Um, I don't think this is something that I can just bounce back out of like, yeah, hey guys, I'm back. Yeah, now you guys will watch me. I don't think it's gonna work like that, unfortunately. So, I will have to move YouTube to a part-time thing. I won't be able to do it every day. I won't be able to commit to it like I have been. And uh, honestly, this really sucks for me because this is the best job anybody could have ever. Like, hell yeah, I'd love to play Minecraft and hang out with awesome freaking kids every day and have amazing fans who support me no matter what I do. Like, fuck yeah, that sounds freaking awesome. Oh my God. Sign me up as fast as you can. Like, I understand why people want to get into this as badly as they do. Like, it's pretty freaking great. This is the best job in the world, period. Big old period mark right there. Like, look at this. Look at this freaking nether hub right here. Somebody virtually just plopped on here, found themselves some a mess of biome, plopped up themselves some hardened clay, colored that bitch and just had at it. And now there is a beautiful piece of artwork just loaded up on my screen. Look at Grazer's cactus. Oh, I have the hiccups. Oh God. <sighs> but unfortunately, everything does come to an end. Unfortunately, unfortunately, I don't really know how to wrap this up. <laughs> Oh yeah, I gotta let you guys know uh, the things I've posted down. Got wool? No, you don't, you loser. All the cool kids buy my wool over there. And I got a... Uh, there was a... What was a little glass block over here? Oh no! No! Okay. Well, I guess a creeper blew up my shit. <laughs> but follow the rainbow. Taste the rainbow. And you got... Why did, why did the hipster burn his tongue? He drank his coffee before it was cool. Ah, 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 that's some good shit. That's some good shit. You got nipple there. But yeah, so you follow the freaking wall and you go over here. Blah, blah, blah. And you 
boom, you got to my wool shop. Oh, all right, well, I guess I think I'm done with my rant about, you know, everything that's happened. Whew, I don't know how long I've been recording this for. My throat is killing me. Uh, but hopefully you guys will leave this video with a little bit more understanding of where I'm coming from and what's going on. Um, I am actually working on a new project, a new social media project. I can't give out too much information because it's still in the works. It's still in beta mode. We have, it has yet to be released, but it is a website that I'm working on, a new social media website. And it is hopefully going to be pretty freaking cool. I'm, I really look forward to publishing it and showing you guys this website because I really do think you guys will enjoy it. Um, I'm not dead once again. I don't want you guys to think I'm just dead, died off the face of the earth. I'll still play Minecraft every now and then as much as I can. Um, right now, I just, I just woke up. I'm not wearing a shirt. I'm in my PJs right now. And I decided to finally get on and give you guys a little bit of an explanation as to where the crap I've been. So, whew, yeah. Yeah. I hope you guys have a wonderful, wonderful day. If you guys have any questions, please, please let me know in the comment section below, and I will try to try to address them as soon as I can. Like I said, I really value myself on being as real of a person as I can be. Unfortunately, this may offend some people. I don't know if what I have said in this video is offensive to anybody. I sincerely apologize if it is. That's not what I'm going for at all. Um, I just want to let people know what's going on. Let people know, let answer a couple questions that have been around for a really long time, such as why I left you crafted or why I don't record with all of my old friends, and it's simply because I can't. <laughs> Nobody invites me to anything. I, oh, I don't know. I don't want to be all like, uh, take pity on me, because I don't want that either. I'm doing all right. I'm happy. I'm happy where my life is. I'm happy with the decisions I'm making based on moving forward. I think life will be all right. No, I have high hopes for the future. I'm not dying. I'm not starving to death. I'll, I'll be all right, guys. It'll be okay. I'm happy. I love you guys. I hope you guys have a wonderful day. And once again, if you guys do have any questions, be sure to leave them down in the comment section below, and I will try to address them maybe in the next video, or over Twitter, or Ask FM, or something, man. I, I will try to address your questions. I promise it. I promise, I promise. Brett, yeah, yeah. So once again, guys, thank you guys for the great memories, and I will see you guys hopefully soon. Oh, also, enjoy the UHC episodes, guys. It'll be coming out, like, every other day at 5 p.m. EST. So Tuesday was the first episode. Thursday will be the next episode. And Saturday and Monday and so on and so forth. It was a good season. I had fun. I was teamed up with Stacy Plays. Uh, I think that's your name, right? It's just Stacy plays. Oh god, I'm a terrible fucking teammate. Anyway, hope you guys enjoy. I'll see you guys later. And I love you all. Goodbye. Goodbye. Not forever though. Not forever. Goodbye until next time. Like pasta manana. See you tomorrow. <laughs> Goodbye, friends. Goodbye.